You want wealth. You are set on a path to acquire it. You've read the blogs. You've watched the videos. You truly know it is possible to make it a reality for yourself. You are ready to forge a path to your dream of financial freedom. So you do it. But there is an unseen part to this process nobody ever talks about. Let's take all the methods the internet has told you to go about acquiring your fortune. Most are scams. But some are not. Some are not. But we still fail at turning those methods into real long-lasting wealth. Why? Someone that has made it will tell you, you didn't work hard enough. But that's just too simplistic. It's not about what you did or did not do to get there. It's all about pure desire. I know it sounds outrageous, but think about it. Every time you truly desire something, it becomes second nature to get it. When you get into a state of hunger, you can't think about anything else. But there's a problem. Hunger cannot be taught. It can only be revealed. It has to be discovered by the individual. When you are hungry, things don't magically become easy. No, it doesn't become easy. But it instantly becomes a need instead of a want. You just can't live without it. The thought of not having it is harder to bear than whatever it takes to get it. So you do it. You do it in spite of everything. It's about what you truly want. Desire is natural and impossible to internally argue with. It's your internal driver. We are so good at lying to ourselves. We think we want something only to realize we don't. The wants of other people disguised as our own. Why is it that every time you try, you burn out and fail? It's because you were doing the wrong thing all along. The moment you pursue the desires of other people, you set yourself up for failure from the very beginning. If you try to get wealth in ways that are against your nature, you are flowing against a harsh river. That will enslave you to a path that makes you miserable and that leads you nowhere. An unfortunate waste of one's life. The true question remains to be asked. What do you truly want? How do you reveal the path you've always been walking on? And how do you transform that into wealth? There is a practical solution. Look at your past. What have you always naturally strived towards? What is that thing that just keeps on reoccurring over and over like a magnetic force that drives you in a certain direction? Call it destiny, call it whatever, it's irrelevant. Look at it, stare it in the eyes. It whispers, it never shouts. What were you like as a child? What are you constantly doing without having to think about it? What has always felt like play to you but work to others? Maybe you like human interaction, figuring things out, or the pure exploration of ideas. Maybe it's something less obvious. That's what you've always wanted. What you might find is that your deepest desires might not align with society's desires. You have been told that money is given to those that solve society's problems. But in truth, money is given to those that solve not its problems, but its desires at mass. If your desires align perfectly with society's desires, you have the finest form of octane to achieve wealth. If not, in order to achieve wealth and not burn out from the hardships, you have to find the intersection between you and society's desires. Don't believe me? Take the top streamers on Twitch. What utility problem do they solve? None. They solve people's desires at mass and get rewarded for it. The problem with common advice is you never wanted a cookie cutter solution. You want an answer 100% tailored to you. And you are the only one to answer that. The rest is just playing the game.